What is Tashlech? Tashlech is a special prayer that we say alongside a body of water, preferably where there are fish. Tashlech means to cast away or throw away. And it's a prayer in which we symbolically cast or throw away our sins. And that is the expression of the prayers that we say during the Tashlech service. It is even customary at the end of the service to shake our pockets or our tzitzis, symbolizing that we are shaking out or throwing away any sins that we may have collected. And the reason why we say it by a body of water is because it recalls the merit of Abraham and Isaac. The Midrash tells us that when Abraham and Isaac were going to the mountain for the binding of Isaac, Satan came to stop them so that they wouldn't fulfill God's order. And he created a rushing river that flowed before them. And it reached up to their nostrils to the point that they almost could no longer walk. And still they continued on their way. And so we recall that merit of Isaac and Abraham. And we say, God, in their merit of such commitment to your will, may you also forgive us for our sins. Water is also the place where the Jewish people always coronate a new king during the biblical times when we had kings. And the reason why is because just as a river flows forever, so may this kingship we wish upon the new king flow forever. And on Rosh Hashanah, when we are coronating God as king, we therefore stand by a body of water in prayer. Another reason is because fish swim in a body of water. And fish symbolize a number of things for the Jewish people. Fish are always threatened by the nets of fishermen who want to catch them. And so too we remind ourselves that we are caught in the net of judgment on Rosh Hashanah, reminding ourselves of the seriousness of the day. Fish, we know, are also free from the evil eye. And so therefore we say prayers by a water, a body of water where there are fish, asking God that we not be affected by the evil eye, by any jealousy that others may have of us. And lastly, fish don't have eyelids, their eyes never close. And so we're in prayer to God asking that we, are, that we always remain under God's watchful eye and that no harm befall us in this upcoming year.